heck is this on her head? Like, why does every grandma have to have that on her head? I told you to stay away! Oh my god! <laughs> All right, guys, today I am in Dayville, Connecticut. I'm kind of confused, though, because apparently this town is also called Killingly, which I don't really get, but it fits because this spirit Halloween is killingly awesome. This appears to be a smaller store, but you never know. Sometimes the smaller stores have the better stuff. So let's go on in and see what they have. Holy crap, guys, right in the door, I see something that I have not seen at any spirit Halloween this year yet. And that would be... Waving Wally. Holy crap, guys, they got a couple cool things that haven't been set up in other stores. And they also got this little zombie guy here. Hello, Wally, I missed you. All right, let's get him rolling here. <laughs> well, he is certainly waving. <laughs> He's kind of hard to hear because of the music. I totally forgot, I expected him to do something else, but he's waving Wally. All he does is wave. Oh sweet, we have a whole bunch of animatronics down through the middle here. We have Sam over here, but we'll go there in a minute, and we have the Nightcrawler right here. Here he comes. Look at this, I love when they have his hair hanging down like that. I think he is so much creepier. A lot of times his hair is tucked up in the hood, but that looks so creepy right there. Let's do it one more time, because I want to see his hair fly when he jumps, watch. Yeah, <laughs> so cool. Kind of reminds me of Demonic Dahlia when she would jump and she, all her hair would fly forward. We got Mr. Red and Black Jumpy here. Hello, fella. I like your fur. Let's go through the tunnel of non-existent chains of death and over to the side here to see what they have hanging out. And it would be little skelly bones. Look at this guy. They even got the hat on him. Are you about to make some pumpkins, sir? I don't know if I've ever seen little skelly bones set up like that, but he's so cool looking. He's not actually doing any skelly boning, but <laughs> I'm such an idiot. All right, guys, let's take a walk through the store here before we come back to those animatronics that are in the boxes on the floor. And we're going to see if there's anything else set up. And it looks like there is. This is a long store, too. And look, we got a couple of things set up over here. That's cool. All right, we don't have Mr. Dark. I always have to look for him just in case. And the elusive clipboard is not here either but we do have some awesome monsters set up over here waiting for us one of them is the hauntress it's so funny when they have the hauntress set up like this oh that looks cool because of all the colors there but it's funny when they have her set up like this because she's supposed to be hiding behind something okay let's see here come on hauntress oh there you go <laughs> scared the crap out of me because she waited to do it. She was like, I'm gonna make this fool wait. But what I was saying was that it's, there you go. <laughs> it's so strange because you never know which way she's gonna go. When she's hiding behind something, you don't even know she's there. So anyway, let's move on to this giant fellow right here. Let me just stand back here for a second and show you this, guys, because it looks pretty cool. It's a little bit darker in this store than it has been in others. So this really looks cool with the blinking lights up here, the flashing lights on top, the little blinking lights here, and then you got the skeletons up here all with their eyes going. They're watching. They must be on the, uh, the sensor because this guy just keeps on going off. He didn't pick her up and there is no fog. He's still cool anyway though, pretty freaky. Okay, let's try out Mr. Howell here, see if he's working. Look how giant he is in here. Look at this, holy crap, is he gonna touch the ceiling? Almost. <laughs> oh my gosh, he almost touches the ceiling, he's so huge. Dang, look at that. Honestly, I wish he growled a little bit more than he does before he howls, or even after. <laughs> so cool. I know, we already listened to you. All right, let's come on over here to Wacky Mole. We got the black lights on. Excuse me, sir. I'm trying to talk to Wacky over here. All right, let's try that again, Wacky. Bad Halloween costumes, baby. 
Look at the shadow. I love how the shadow's moving back and forth up there. So these guys must all be on sensors because they just keep going off. But look at this. We got a little spider down here all alone, and I don't know. Hmm. I can't get him to jump, so hello, Spidey. You'll get your life back soon. Quiet, mister. All right, let's take a walk back here real quick and see if they have any other animatronics on the floor, even in boxes. I do not see any back in this area. Look at this. I don't know if I've seen this one before. Spinning head harlequin. Oh, cool. Look. I don't know if she's supposed to light up or make sound. I don't hear anything. I don't see any lights, but look how her head spins. That is so cool. <laughs> I love that. Spinning head harlequin. All right. We got this shaky guy right here, which is the only one out of this whole lineup that works right now. You probably have to pull those little tabs on here somewhere, but I'm just not gonna do that if it's not already pulled. I like the looks of this scary guy. And of course we have our zombie babies. I'm still looking for another zombie burrito baby. Oh, look at this. We got the Good Times doll and I have seen him before, but I don't think I've ever seen this one. The Clown Haunted doll. What in the world? Let's see if we can try him. What's he supposed to do? Where's the button? He's laughing. Okay. Yeah, he's turned down so quiet you can't understand what he's saying, but he is pretty cool. And I have never seen him in a store before. Well, Mr. Clown Haunted Doll, we're gonna leave you a few stickers right there. Look at this undead head. It almost looks like Mr. Dark. That is creepy, I love it. Okay, we got a handful of animatronics up here in the middle that we're gonna go look at, but here's the bunch of uh, jumping spiders. We got the black one, we got the black and red, and we have the brown. Most stores have all three of the, uh, the jumping spiders if you want one or the other. So let's see what they have in stock right here. Right off the bat, we have the Nightcrawler. Yes, very, very cool. Creepy crimson girl on a swing. You gotta love that one. And again, we have like six sitting scarecrows. And over here, we have a headless help. I haven't seen him for a while. Followed by the Night Stalker. I'm actually kind of surprised they don't have him set up. We got some clown toe tappers on the top here. Oh, they're working too. Tap them. We got both of them going. See, this is what I love about going to all the different stores. You don't see all the same stuff in every store. Look at this. What the heck? It's like a Jack Skellington Mickey or something. What in the world? Vamp Teddy, it's called. I don't even know what the heck that is. I thought it was Jack Skellington, but I guess not. That is Jack Skellington. That is not. That is Sally. I guess it was the stripes that totally threw me off because he's right beside Jax. I don't know. Whatever. I'm out of here. Here's a bouncy pillow Jack Skellington. Scary gargoyle pathway markers. I wish they made sounds. I thought they did the last time I played them, but um, I guess not. They just light up. That's all. You got to put your own sounds in. We got the vintage clowns, but there's no button to push. We got the creepy pathway skulls. I love those like lightning oh wait we got some more down here let's see if there's a button there you go very cool okay i see some purge stuff here a couple people asked me to look at the purge stuff so here's one mask here's another one kiss me that's pretty freaky here's this guy uh let's see oh we got this one down here I just saw this one for the first time the other day. We got a Purge shirt. I purged. I survived the Purge. That's pretty cool. Here we got the Purge election year. Okay. And then we got another shirt here. The Purge anarchy. An American tradition. Nothing on the back. And of course, even though it doesn't say Purge on it, here's all kinds of cool weapons you could use if you were purging. I especially like this one, the giant screwdriver. Oh, look at this. Here's the baby with a skin stick, which is pretty creepy. But then the, here's this one that has like that same feel to the stick, almost like it's supposed to be skin. It's like rubbery. And this skull that totally creeps me out. Oh my gosh, look, they actually have a Billy Butcherson mask. 
I haven't seen the Billy Butcherson mask for such a long time. $49.99. Billy, you silly guy. Look at Grandma. <laughs> what the heck is this on her head? Like, why does every grandma have to have that on her head? I am offended for you, Grandma. Of course, here's also super soft old woman. <laughs> Look at the curls. That just cracks me up. Oh, this is one where you put your chin right in there and her mouth moves with yours. That is super creepy. Oh look guys, we got a Slenderman Super Skins costume. That's pretty cool, but you would pretty much have to be like super tall to pull that off. Okay, we're gonna leave you a couple of stickers, Miss Hauntress. There you go. And how about a couple of stickers for Beetlejuice? Guys, I don't think we did Sam. I think I completely passed him by. I'm sorry, Sam, buddy. Here you go. All right, there you go. And here's a whole bunch of trick-or-treat stuff besides Sam. We got the Sam hangers. You just hang them up somewhere. Pretty cool. The treat bag. We got the clown, bunny, and skeleton mask. Sam string lights, which are, oh, they're actually blinking down here already. Look, Sam's rules of Halloween book. Sam's sucker, and this is one you can actually eat. Got the Sam costume, and yeah, this one comes with the mask. I didn't think it did. Jumpsuit, gloves, and mask. That's the full costume right there. Or you can get the deluxe Sam mask here. And they have Sam socks, too. Look at this, guys. I don't think I saw this before. You got all these different Different kinds of socks which I have seen but down here you have like a whole pack of horror movie socks that is sweet look at this guys they have the nightmare on Elm Street cards here I think these are the ones we were looking for the other day and we couldn't find them and look at this awesome Edward Scissorhands decal this is cool oh look at the Chucky socks and they only have one pair left all right they're mine Crap, look guys, I almost missed this. They actually have spirit hats in this one. I haven't seen those in any other stores. Okay, well, that is it, guy, for this store. Can't even remember where we're at now. I've been to so many. Oh, Dayville, Connecticut. Killingly, that's what it is. There it is, Killingly, Connecticut. I got my Chucky socks, and I am heading to another spirit Halloween. <laughs> Stay away! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs>